have no mercy in this land. Death don't have no mercy in this land. And they come to your house and it won't stay long. You look in the bed, somebody be gone. Death don't have no mercy in this land. Looking for a game with cool bosses, boob armor physics, and enough mindless grinding to keep you busy for the rest of your miserable gaming life? Welcome to Black Desert Online, the MMO sensation that's sweeping the nation. Well, really only in South Korea. It's like Sword Art Online, but not fucking dumb. This is actually just a high school girl getting tentacle raped. Good going, Sword Art. It has all your favorite things you like in a hardcore game, like cooking, fishing, making potions, fighting things that don't do damage to you, and more cooking. This game has taken so much of my life from me. Black Desert Online is an MMO which stands for making money online, but unlike World of Warcraft, there's no way to sell your gear for actual money. So that armor you just spent 800 hours grinding for is totally worthless. What does that mean? I'm gaining weight and losing my girlfriend at the same time! This game is actually beautiful, and if you aren't careful, you can waste an entire day away on it. I can't tell if I'm actually having fun or if I'm enjoying the massive amounts of endorphins my brain is pumping into me every time I get juicy new gear. I've never seen an MMO with better graphics and more content that focuses so heavily on actual combat gameplay and not smashing your face on your hotkeys. Like, actually, the combat on this game would give your 80-year-old ED grandfather an erection lasting longer than five hours that would get granny going, <laughs> One of the most amazing things about Black Desert Online is its lore that you can tell the game creators worked meticulously on so that you could just spam click the fuck out of the continue button because who actually reads the lore, am I right? Seriously though, I've put over 400 hours into this game and I don't even know why it's called Black Desert. The desert isn't even black. It's a normal desert. I feel good. Honestly though, there is so much you can do in this game. You wanna go hunt magical monsters with a musket? You can do that. You wanna set up a trade route from here to here that literally takes 30 minutes of in-game traveling? You can do that. You wanna run and manage a list of 60 workers that passively give you money in exchange for beer? You can do that too. There's a huge map to explore, whether it be by land or by sea. Just watch out for the new sea monsters, because they will fuck you up. And every place you go feels just as amazing as the last, with tons of different unique enemies and quests. I constantly find myself veering off the beaten path to go explore this cave or that mountain, only to find that there's a secret enemy to fight or NPC to chat with about some rare quest that gives me even better loot. Black Desert focuses heavily on its in-game economy and marketplace where making money is the best way to get great gear. And there's a ton of ways to make some money. You can do quests, fight enemies, trade, sell, breed horses, gather resources, kill bosses, or a million other ways. You guys remember back in the good old days when you would flip open your mom's laptop with your greasy ass fingers and indulge in a session of Wizard 101 where you grind it away to get that new awesome spell that literally everyone else gets by doing the same thing? Well, throw that shit out the window, because this is Black Desert Online, baby. To get better stuff, you have to kill things to drop better stuff. Then you have to sit around pumping away all your money into upgrading that gear, which is based off of a random chance generator that can make you feel like the last four hours of getting money was a complete waste of time. On top of that, when your gear makes it to a certain level, it will downgrade if you fail an upgrade, meaning you now have to go grind even more to get the gear back to what it was in the first place. Black Desert is well known for its RNG system that has led to many broken monitors. This game is cancer. Another thing that makes Black Desert 
stand out from other MMOs is how heavily PvP or player versus player based it is. Really the ultimate end game for a Black Desert player is to form or join a strong guild that you fight with for control over the game's major cities and territories, which in turn gives you more money based on the taxed items that are sold there. This leads to all out guild wars between raging streamers over who gets control over the sand people and who gets control over this hill. The bottom line is that I like Black Desert Online. I mean, I have literally not uploaded videos thanks to this game. It has amazing graphics, great combat, lots of variety, and a price tag of only $10. There's also microtransactions for important things like underwear. Nothing screams I'm ready for battle like some lace. If you don't have a girlfriend or a social life, then buy this game. It's worth it and will keep you entertained for as long as you can stand failing an enhancement. Alright baby, this is the one. This is it right here. Oh yeah. Fuck!